Ready? Hey, welcome to Weld.com, live today at the American Welding Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. I have a gentleman with me, John Minch. He's a product engineer and a degreed welder. Uh, we have a new line of product here called the? It's called the Renegade 300S. 300S, so it's small inverter machine. Uh, it looks stick and TIG only, is that, yes. is that correct? This is a stick and TIG only machine, DC only output. Okay. Nope, 300 amps output. 300 amps. That's too little to be putting out 300 amps. How much does this weigh? It only weighs about 35 pounds. 35 pounds. We're going to pick up 300 amps and carry it around. That's cool. Um, Input, what do, we, what do we require for input power? So our, uh, our voltage input, we're looking at 208, 230, 460 volt, uh, single or three phase. Okay, auto link, I can just plug into anything yep. and machine's gonna read that, automatically know that it's 208 or 230. Yes sir. That's you very, very convenient. Either direct wire or put your own plug on it and you're ready to roll. Okay, so we're sticking TIG, we've got a remote control, we're no high freak, we're, we're doing touch start, correct? That's Lift correct. Lift start, That's okay. Correct. I've got my hand on an item here. Uh, I'm thinking this is just too cool right here. 50 foot lead of a remote control. So I can be away from this machine. I don't have to go back to the machine or holler to somebody. I can, I can dial up amperages. Um, what else can I do here on this face that I can also do it right here? So. The two things, two functions you have with this remote is one, you already said it was your, if you don't mind, sorry, uh, is your amperage adjustment. So as I dial my amperage up or down, I'm also adjusting it on the machine. Nice. So to top that off, the operators are looking for a little bit of arc force control because they may be switching between a 6010 and a 7018 or going to a deck rod, a 6022, and you know, we want to be able to give them some flexibility so I can adjust my arc force and I can take that to whatever setting that's, that fits my needs as a welder. Nice, very nice. So um, let's say that we've got an arc force here. I've got, this will go from zero to, what we got, 100? Yeah, 100, zero so 100 percent. Well, let's say, let's say that we're running a 6010 and we're down here about uh, 35 percent on this scale, okay? okay? What kind of an arc feature are we going to see with that? Okay, I'm going to have a little bit more of a driving arc on this one, where it, and it may spread out the arc a little bit more. It's going to be a little bit more uh, crisp. I'm I'm going to have a the best way I can explain it is a little bit more violent, a little bit more spatter. Okay. Uh, you know, maybe some long arcing in, in some senses as well. We need to do that sometimes when we're running uh, hot passes and stuff. We lift that. Get that freezing effect on a 6010 or 7010. Nice feature. Slag. Nice feature. Very nice. 300. This is amazing. This is amazing. Uh, standard dense connects. Yeah, we're running the 50 millimeter dense connections. We want to make sure we got enough amperage output to our leads so we can get that full 300 amps. Sweet. We very nice. Uh, I'm excited to try one of these one of these days. I, I'm going to get on this one of these days. I want to. I want to pull the trigger on this. We've got a gentleman back here, Andrew from Cincinnati, Ohio. Uh, like a weld, let's hear this thing run. Let's, let's do this. Uh, he's running a 7018, eighth inch 7018. He's running on a different machine than we have in the camera. He's on it on 115 amps. Is that running pretty sweet? It looks like it through the viewing shield here. That spatter is nice and light. I'm not seeing any hard spatter coming off of there. You know, sometimes with a 7018, you get that pool that just explodes. I'm not seeing that. I'm thinking this thing is just super smooth. Uh, John, really got to thank you. This was uh, a good demo. Really excited about running this product. I see some real, real benefit here. This is so cool. Uh, small, compact, powerful. Uh, this is going to be great. Great line. Thank proud you, to sir. proud to be involved with it. I'm 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 just dying to give it a test run, man. It's going to be like hopping in a Corvette and hammering down, huh? Yeah. Thank yeah. you very much. Thank you, Bob. Hey, I this is cool. It. This is fun stuff here. Uh, 
again, make sure you subscribe to the videos. Uh, we're live at the American Welding Show, Fabtech, Las Vegas, Nevada. Thanks for watching.